Swing trading captures short to medium term price moves, perfect for beginners as it doesn't require constant monitoring like day trading. Swing traders hold trades for a few days to a few weeks, aiming to profit from price swings. This style balances time commitment and profit potential. Unlike long-term investing, swing trading focuses on technical analysis and market sentiment. It's about identifying patterns and trends to capitalize on price fluctuations. Imagine riding a swing, entering at a low point and exiting at a high point. While fundamental analysis is relevant, swing traders prioritize technical indicators and chart patterns. In the next sections, we'll delve into technical analysis and its application in swing trading. By understanding the basics and following a disciplined approach, you can increase your chances of success in the stock market. The Nifty 50, comprising India's top 50 companies, offers a vibrant playground for swing traders. Among these giants, Tata Motors and Infosys stand out as popular picks. Tata Motors, a leading automobile manufacturer, and Infosys, an IT behemoth, experience significant price swings, presenting lucrative opportunities. By analyzing historical price charts, swing traders can identify recurring patterns and trends in Tata Motors and Infosys. These patterns, combined with technical indicators, help traders anticipate future price movements and make informed decisions. In the upcoming sections, we'll equip you with the technical tools and fundamental insights needed to analyze these stocks. Get ready to navigate the exciting world of swing trading with confidence. Technical analysis is the bread and butter of swing trading. It involves studying price charts and using indicators to predict future price movements. Three powerful indicators used by swing traders are RSI, moving averages, and MACD. The Relative Strength Index, or RSI, measures the strength and momentum of price movements. It oscillates between 0 and 100, with readings above 70, indicating overbought conditions, and readings below 30, suggesting oversold conditions. Swing traders use RSI to identify potential trend reversals and entry or exit points. Moving averages smooth out price data to reveal trends. The most common are the 50-day and 200-day moving averages. When the shorter-term moving average crosses above the longer-term one, it's considered a bullish signal and vice versa for a bearish signal. The Moving Average Convergence Divergence, or MACD, is a trend-following momentum indicator. By combining these indicators and understanding their signals, swing traders can make more informed trading decisions. It's crucial to use them in conjunction with other analyses and risk management techniques. While technical analysis is crucial for swing trading, understanding the fundamentals of a company adds another layer of confidence to your trades. Key metrics to look out for include revenue growth, earnings per share, and the price to earnings ratio. Revenue growth indicates a company's ability to generate sales and expand its business. Increasing revenue is a positive sign for investors and often translates into higher stock prices. Earnings per share, or EPS, measure a company's profitability on a per share basis. Higher EPS generally signifies a more profitable company, making it more attractive to investors. Track EPS growth over time to assess a company's financial health. The price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio, compares a company's stock price to its earnings per share. By incorporating fundamental analysis into your swing trading strategy, you can make more informed decisions and identify companies with strong growth potential. A well-rounded approach considers both technical and fundamental factors for optimal results. Section 5. Swing Trading Strategies for Beginners Now that you understand the basics of technical and fundamental analysis, let's explore some swing trading strategies tailored for beginners. Trend Trading this strategy involves identifying an established trend and riding it until it shows signs of reversal. Use moving averages and MACD to confirm the trend direction. Look for stocks making higher highs and higher lows in an uptrend and lower lows and lower highs in a downtrend. Breakout Trading 
This strategy capitalizes on price breakouts from established trading ranges or chart patterns. Look for stocks consolidating within a range and then breaking out with strong volume. Use RSI to confirm overbought or oversold conditions before entering a trade. News-based trading This strategy involves trading around major news events or company announcements. Remember to adapt and refine your approach based on your risk tolerance, market conditions and personal preferences. And turn. Section 6. Identifying Buy Signals A step-by-step -step guide. Let's break down the process of identifying buy signals using technical indicators, combining the power of RSI, moving averages and MACD. Start with the trend. Identify the overall trend of the stock using a long-term moving average, like the 200-day MA. Is the stock trading above or below it? This gives you the primary direction. Look for pullbacks. In an uptrend, look for the price to pull back towards the 50-day MA. This is a potential buy zone. Confirm with RSI. As the price approaches the 50-day MA, check the RSI. Is it below 30? This suggests the stock might be oversold, increasing the probability of a bounce. Validate with MACD. Look for the MACD line to cross above its signal line. Entry point. Consider entering the trade when all three indicators align. A pullback to the 50-day MA, oversold RSI, and a bullish MACD crossover. Managing risk and mastering your emotions. Trading psychology is crucial for success. Fear and greed lead to impulsive decisions. Set stop-loss orders to manage risk. Limit potential losses with stop-loss orders. Place them below support or above resistance. Don't risk more than you can afford. Calculate position size based on risk tolerance. Stick to your plan and avoid chasing losses. Take profits strategically and keep learning. Section 8. Real-time examples. Tata Motors and Infosys in action. Let's apply what we've learned to real-time examples using Tata Motors and Infosys. Scenario 1. Tata Motors. Imagine. Tata Motors is trading above its 200-day moving average, indicating an uptrend. The price pulls back to the 50-day moving average, presenting a potential buy zone. The RSI is below 30, suggesting oversold conditions, and the MACD line crosses above its signal line, confirming bullish momentum. This confluence of signals presents a potential swing trading opportunity. Scenario 2. Infosys. Now, envision Infosys trading below its 200-day moving average, signifying a downtrend. This alignment of signals suggests a potential swing trade to the downside. Section 9. Patience and Practice. The Keys to Success. Swing trading requires patience and practice. Don't expect overnight riches. Focus on the process and learn from mistakes. Start small to gain experience. Use demo accounts to practice strategies. Familiarize yourself with the platform. Regularly analyze your trades. Identify patterns and improve. Stay updated on market trends. Section 10. Conclusion. Embracing the Swing Trader's Mindset. Swing trading offers a compelling avenue for individuals seeking to participate in the stock market and potentially profit from short to medium term price fluctuations. By understanding the principles of technical analysis, utilizing indicators like RSI, moving averages and MACD and incorporating fundamental insights, beginners can navigate the complexities of the market with greater confidence. Remember, swing trading is not a get-rich-quick scheme and success requires dedication, discipline and continuous learning. Embrace the journey, manage your risk effectively and never stop seeking knowledge. With patience, practice and a commitment to honing your skills, you can embark on a rewarding swing trading adventure. So, embrace the swing trader's mindset, stay curious and never stop learning.